Hello there ladies and gents and welcome to Digitrip. Today we are taking a look at the mod for XCOM 2, Long War 2. And this is gonna be part 2. There's a lot of 2's in there, uh, but let's not waste any time and jump right into it. Alrighty. Alright, so this is your honeycomb, or your ant farm, or whatever you want to call it. Basically, this is going to be your command center where you initiate all of your missions, research alien technologies, get better armor, recruit new soldiers, contact the resistance, all of that fun stuff. You would use all these different sections to build out new buildings that will help you in the war. Uh, I'm thinking about how I want to execute this video series. I may actually like show off using the base system a lot, or maybe I'll primarily just show like actual mission footage. Not entirely certain yet, but Right off the get-go, I think that we should make something. So, what should we make? Uh, laboratory would help increase the production time of researching things. So that's kind of important. I actually think that's probably one of the more important things. Uh, there's usually, I think, like some kind of building meta that people use when playing XCOM 2. Uh, I don't know what it is. So, how many supplies do we have? 175? It costs 125 to build a lab. Uh, yeah, fuck it. It's too important. Lab will start work on the new facility right away, Commander. I'll send word when it's up and running. One of the coolest things also about the game is that you can see all your little soldiers just kind of living their lives while uh, you work around the base. Every single one of these little NPCs are soldiers that I can send out into the field. Um, but you all probably know this already. If you're here looking at an XCOM mod, it's probably because you've played the original game. You want to see what Long War 2 is picking up some weird transmissions lately. It sounds a little like German, but it's hard to tell. Thank you, Bradford. He always interrupts me. Uh, okay, so yeah, if you're looking at this, you probably know XCOM, so let's just get right into it. One of the new features is apparently what they've done with the map. Uh, so, I actually had to restart the campaign because a, U uh, a YouTuber, a subscriber, maybe, are you a YouTuber? If you are, let me know. I'm gonna have to look at your uh, channel. Anyway, um, a fellow subscriber, told me that my squad was wrong, that uh, the abilities that each of these soldiers had was not correct, and that it was from the original base game rather than the Long War II mod. So make a long story short, I had to restart the campaign and tweak some of my other mods a bit so it gave me the correct abilities for these soldiers. Thank you, by the way, for pointing that out. Uh, it took me like five tries to get everything to be basically back to the way it was, but now it is. So, let's do this. Um, if you know what guerrilla ops are, you know, you attack different regions that belong to the advent and you hit places of importance to them. Maybe rescuing a soldier or a scientist or blowing up a convoy, you know, whatever, and getting resources for it. So, for example, I get 20 intel and an intel package. Um, baseline enemy activity extremely light, so this should be an easy, in theory, mission to do. Let's get over there and see what, what happens. That was the little black market icon, by the way, if you were wondering. Again, I probably don't need to describe any of this if you all play XCOM and you know what you're in for. Alright. So our squad looks pretty much good to go. I like my little, like... He looks like a Navy SEAL. He's awesome. Alright. So we're gonna send our guys into the into the field. One of the nice new additions to the game is squads. So you can create squads. And you would send these squads out on various missions and stuff, and they have this new uh, game mechanic called, I think it's Infiltration. So I'm actually gonna go and drop these soldiers off at the Infiltration point. I'm not entirely certain how the mechanic works, but the mission doesn't start right away. What they're actually gonna be doing what I'm pretty sure they're actually gonna be doing here is they will be scanning the area and trying to find out any positions essentially so I just dropped them off and so now the infiltration is at zero percent so this is a completely new mechanic and I'm still trying to figure out what exactly it all means but now I guess I just wait right uh, because right now the enemy activity is heavy, so my soldiers are undercover. Uh, the more people that you send on a mission on a guerrilla ops, the longer the infiltration will take. Um, so right now the enemy readiness is impregnable, so I probably shouldn't do that now. I should wait. Um, I can view who's there. All of this is completely new. It's really cool. Um, I can abort the mission if I decide that it's not worth it. But it is worth it. It's the only guerrilla ops that we have. 
I have to wait nine days until I so I have nine days and nine hours until I have to launch so we'll see how much percentage that will go up within that nine days and again depending on how many you bring to the mission will determine how fast it goes the more you have the longer it takes and the less percentages you'll get so it's kind of like a risk and reward system right how many people do you want to send on a mission to get the job done so let's start scanning then actually they're infiltrating pretty damn well although nice. we have allies scattered in cities throughout the globe who are willing to share their knowledge of advent's operations the aliens are actively pursuing them it will be up to you well, to shit. ensure the safety of our operatives commander good luck i won't lie i didn't actually expect two missions to pop up but that's actually one of the things that xcom 2 does apparently um <laughs> huh that's really interesting all right so apparently you can have multiple missions going at once so if i click confirm i've got to make a new squad all right uh who have i got see this is why they give you so many soldiers at the get-go so let's just start filling this up because there's no point in wasting time here uh should i make another full squad <laughs> oh i forgot <laughs> i forgot i made my gun here Okay, uh, and I'll throw Rebecca in there also, another friend of mine. And I will throw... Well, I'll just fill it up. Fill it up. But you know, maybe that's enough. That might be enough. Ah, fuck it. <laughs> Send everybody into the field. No, no. This will be enough. This will be, this will be good enough. I don't want to send everybody at once. Let's be smart about this. So start. <laughs> oh my god, I forgot about Mike's character. He's gonna kill me. <laughs> Wait, what nationality was he from? Was that Korea on his back? I thought I saw a Korean flag on his back. We're in the pipe. Five by five. Alright, you guys start infiltrating. I feel like Mike's gonna give it away. Wait. Let's get a new. Assignment, shall we? Modular weapons. Are I'll see that work begins immediately, Commander. Yeah, you do that. I'll contact you when I have a full report available. Good. Commander, we can now work to establish contact with local resistance groups operating out of regions around the globe. Once we've collected sufficient intel. Oh we my know, God! We'll need to They're not the wasting any time. Oh wow. Okay. Three missions. It's a good thing I didn't bring everybody. Lima squad will be made up of who's left? Okay, I've got enough for like a full squad. Oh, that's another friend. I, I apparently just make fun of my friends and give them ridiculous outfits. The Avenger is going to be completely empty. Nobody is going to be on board this ship <laughs> to protect it. All right, everybody, get going. Nice hair on that person in the corner. Sky Ranger deployed. So this is a little intimidating. I probably shouldn't have put this on commander mode. But you know what? Fuck it. I can make contact actually with other regions also. That could be important. After we pay the initial intel cost to make contact, we'll have to scan the region for a few days before the local resistance sure. cell Let's comes do out of hiding. Once we find them, we'll be up and running in the new region. Let's do that. That sounds like a good Commander, idea. Commander, using intel collected so far, we've managed to locate a resistance cell operating out of this region. It'll take us some time to scan for their exact position, though. All the different stuff I've unlocked. Fantastic. Biotech. I foresee a number of valuable applications stemming from this technology. I'll have a Everything's already so as different as the research is complete. Okay, so they've infiltrated 41%. That's not bad. I have to launch this mission now, or I have to abort it if I decide that it's not worth it. I get 32 intel for it, so I could use the intel. Uh, the enemy readiness is fortified. 
but there's no point for me not to strike, right? God, this is so cool. It already makes it feel so much more like an actual resistance group because in the base game, you really could only um, send one squad out at a time and you know, risk failing multiple missions. This one, I've just got soldiers all over the place now. I really feel like I'm actually part of resistance movement. This is really, really, really cool. Okay, let's launch this mission. Menace 1 5. We've got a bead on the advent data vault near your position. Be advised, self detonating charges are in place at the target. Move to disarm and extract the package before its contents are destroyed. So, some of these missions never really yeah, made much sense to me. Why the hell are they just randomly blowing up their own stuff? Right? If that's been there for months, why are they just arbitrarily blowing it up now? The data vault. Like, it should be like, oh, they're extracting all the data. Or something, I don't know. Weird weird narrative decisions. But you know what? We're not gonna waste any time. Let's, do this. Let's just get moving. Because I've got an eight turn timer to get all this done. It's not a lot of time. I'm on the move. What is up with your hair? Overwatch. Hmm. No cover between here and there, so I'm just gonna. Todo cubierto. Where's the enemy? Don't actually know where they are. Oh wait, I think I hear them over on that angle. Yeah, they're over there. Okay, let's let's just move smart and quiet. Me dirijo a la posición indicada. Even though time is not exactly on our side here. Everyone, be careful, please. <laughs> uh, check corners. Should I sprint you to there? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to book it. Fuck, that is not a lot of time. Let's put you right there. Tempo. Please don't get spotted. Oh, thank God. Okay, cool. So that area is clear. Let's move you over here. Then. God, there's like <laughs> no cover. Perseguida. Yeah, boy. On the move. Solid copy. Good job, squad. What was that? Okay, cool. So they are coming from that direction. I thought that they might. Hopefully, they don't spot my soldiers before I can get them into better cover. Cool. Doesn't look like they did. Uh, let's move you here first. We got anything? No. Cool. Those are civilians, so they're not gonna move, so they're not gonna spot me. So let's move you here. Objetivos enemigos a la vista. Ah! That's where they are. Okay. Then we'll just keep moving quietly. Moving out. Over to this direction. Verstanden. Hope. For the love of God, that they don't come over here. Heading to that location. You know, in fact, if they got are, it covered. We'll be ready. Set up an ambush. Me muevo a la posición. <laughs> Why did I make her speak Spanish? I don't even know. That's a friend of mine. She's Canadian. Uh. Go ahead. Move you over here. Yep, cool. They are moving in that direction. Just like I thought. Cool, but they didn't spot anybody. But if any of my guys move, then they're dead. Or they'll be spotted. So, I can't waste a turn here either. So, what I'm gonna do is. Overwatch. You and Overwatch. Overwatch. Roger. I've got my eyes on. This is really the only opportunity we're gonna have, I think. Go 
Okay. Augen auf. I could blind all of them. Can I throw a grenade and hit all of them? I could. Oh, that's not bad. I'll have you throw the grenade and you be in Overwatch. Get all three. Perfect. Great, we got one. Games begin! Good shot! Good shot! Up, uh, and now I know that they're gonna be sending more reinforcements. Up, uh, there must be another sectoid over there. Game glitched out, but I'm sure that's what it was trying to show off. Yep, because it just revived someone. Oh, what a wonderful ambush. Yes! Perfect. Great job, guys. Alright, let's not waste any time. We're gonna have to keep moving. We can't delay! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! <laughs> Hmm. What do we do here? Well, all right. <laughs> uh, you just used your grenade. You're not gonna be able to puncture all that armor. Good. Freaking out. So many targets. Oh god, I don't know what to do. Okay. Don't panic. Move into designated position. Don't panic. Shit! <laughs> Shit, I did not expect them all to be there. Could maybe blind some no, that's not really gonna do anything either. That zombie's gonna be a problem, so we're gonna have to shoot it. Zombie still a zombie. Enemy eliminated. Zombie dealt with. But we're not really gonna do any damage to anybody here. I don't even know if I want to waste the shot. We could damage those drones, because those things can stun you for a long time, I found out. Uh, <laughs> any of them, so... What are you doing way over here? Get in the fight. Yeah, I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna have to just blow up the grenade at that thing. And hope for the best. Armor shredded. Okay. Not great, but I'll, it'll have to do. Please hit it. Oh. Yeah, because it's a little better than. No! Oh, I knew that was gonna happen. I knew they weren't gonna hit it. Well, you are my only hope. I could throw the grenade, but I'd rather shred that one. So, please. 50% chance! God damn it! <laughs> okay. 
now they're gonna have free raid. I need to reload soon. Yep, and now it's gonna stun her probably. Is she gonna go down? Yep. Damn, those things are annoying. I'm gonna try to mind control some of this. Yep, yeah, that's what I need to get back. No! Get him back it's gonna make him panic. Okay. Shit, but I still have to actually. Oh, he's been disoriented. And he's panicked. Problem because he was the closest option that I had to to getting to that data vault. That all you got? So he's panicking and disoriented, which means that someone's gonna have to make a mad dash. If we want to get this in time. Oh, that doesn't feel good. I'm gonna have to use him. Minus one five. The clock is ticking. That detonator isn't going to wait. Get to the vault and disarm it before we run out of time. Yeah. Shit. Yeah. I'm fucking kidding. That was like no time at all. Uh. You have three turns to make it over there. There's no way I can pull it off. Barrel, what? Oh shit! Okay. Idea. Crazy idea that might just work. Okay. This is gonna be on you to make a play. Come on, lady. Got this. I've got it. Blow that thing sky high, please. Please kill that surveillance drone. Thank you. You have... We have no time to get to that thing. Damn it, they would have stunned him. I hope that doesn't blow up the car's weight. Shredded armor. Just need to do two damage to that thing. That shouldn't be impossible. I'm still worried though about. No, don't shoot at him again! Okay, cool. Alright, that one hurt. Oh boy, okay. Evac. No, don't Evac. panic! Evac. You just no, took a no. shot to the gut, you're fine! Oh no. I need a med kit here. Cover the blanks. Fuck. Puedo intentarlo. Two turns. And much up. Uh, yeah, no, fuck it. I have to. No need to ask twice. We've got eyes on the objective. No, there's more people That's in there. Five. This is Avenger. We have positive confirmation of the target package. Fuck. Move to acquire. I've got eyes on the Holy objective. shit! There's so many more. There's so much more. So much more. Oh no. Oh god. Everything's scattered, everything's fucked. Oh look, crazy shot. Thanks, XCOM. Everyone's panicked. These guys aren't gonna get out of here. Get the Sky Ranger back here. This is Firebrand. 
evac request confirmed. Hold tight. There is nothing that we can do. Oh, you got it! I want to keep you alive. Even though you're paying. There's no way he's going to be able to get through all that. Oh my god, there's more coming! What? <laughs> oh my god. That guy wasn't kidding where he's like, you're doing this on commander mode, you're so screwed. I said, how hard could it be? Now we know. No! Oh, hey, you hit someone. He's bleeding out, too. Fuck. No, the squad is gonna die. Oh god. Oh god. Ow. Ow. Isn't there supposed to be like a difficulty scaling like slowly over time it gets harder? It put me on the very opposite side of the map and put like 20 soldiers in my pad. Jesus Christ. What even is this? Oh my god. There's... There's no way I can do this one! This, this mission's a bust. This mission is a bust. No! Oh, you look so cool! Gabriel Ruiz, no! Okay. Uh. Dennis one five, you're almost out of time. The detonator is about to blow. I know. We can't do anything about it. Fall back. Position confirmed. We have to salvage something from this. We have four turns before we can retreat. And you're having a panic attack, so... Damn it, Cassie! You had one job! Uh... Game? There we go. Look at this shambling fuck. Damn it, didn't even kill him. You're really good. Oh my god. All right. Well, at least they've got armor to keep them protected. Oh come on! What? It's all gone horribly wrong, guys. This is going horribly wrong. But you know what? That was the point of this entire video series. Every blunder, every misstep every victory you guys are going to be going through with me on this as we try to salvage a victory somehow okay uh, commander the package has been destroyed waste of fucking time and energy lost did nothing but lose lives we're green to go Can you guys not have panic attacks, please? Oh, wait! That's not gonna kill the zombie, but I feel like that advent soldier might be a bigger threat. Fuck it, not like there's much else we can do here. Your panics. Everything's gone. No way! No way! Are you serious right now? You're dropping more units. It's 
it. This is what commander mode difficulty is. Oh my god, they dropped them behind us! Holy shit! Holy... Oh no! Lament for my soldiers. Oh no. Goodbye. If I can get one person out of here. Just one. I should have put the retreat marker a lot further away. I didn't think that this was going to happen. Well, I was going to try to salvage you, but I think that you're probably going to die, too. There. <laughs> Incoming! Over here! <laughs> I have no words at how many units they've just thrown at me. You know what? You all can just die. I don't even care. You all can just be dead. Oh boy. Can I at least evac Cassie? I have no uh into the building, fuck it. Tempo. This is all gone shit. <laughs> this is all gone to shit so fast. Oh! Overwatch! Whew, thank god. Get out of there, ladies! God. XCOM! This will be great. This will be a lot of fun. Uh, join us next time as I try to salvage this mess. Fuck. Ah.